Good morning, figaholic friend. This is a an unknown fig that was named Fat Fig by the Felix Gillet Institute. Um, Felix Gillet um, had started what was named the um, Barren Hill Nursery up in Nevada City, California, and from, I'm working from memory here, which I have got many things in my mind here, but see, I think he came from France to California, you know, maybe in the gold rush years or thereabouts, um, a little bit later, and he was a barber, but he had a passion for plants, and he introduced many plants to the United States. We can thank Felix Gillet. I know for introducing um, hazelnuts into the United States, um, Cabernet, Cabernet Sauvignon grapes, which is a huge, hugely popular um, wine grape here and grown in California. Uh, many other things. He brought figs and chestnuts and um, I forget, uh, uh, walnuts. And Amigo Bob started, and Amigo Bob is a a uh, pioneer of the organic food movement in California um, and um, I, he's come to our orchard um, s several years ago maybe five years ago now need to get him to come back but he started the Felix Gillet Institute to try to um, memorialize the work of Felix Gillet and they do sell some plants and this was a tree they discovered growing in the Nevada City area and they're they oh apples and Felix Gillet had introduced they've tried to find varieties that he introduced and sometimes you know they don't know whether it's a tree for sure that he introduced and what variety it might be but if they find some ancient trees in the area they try to keep those um, propagated and spread and I bought this tree from them and um, when I was here three days ago I think um, I didn't have any ripe fruit they should be I, they have a nice picture on their website it is a flat squatty fig I think sitting on a rock they're very attractive um, somewhat a horizontal cavity not cavity but um, a dividing point in it let's see how this is it's a bit overripe, but not sour at all, but past prime. There was another one down here. Oh, this is even more overripe. I'm not going to even bite into this. I don't think it, it's very sweet. So I don't think it's sour. It's drying right on the tree. I'll go ahead and tear it apart. Um, you're just looking at it from memory on their website. And they don't ship trees. You got to buy them locally. Though so they come to some of our California root fruit grower events. Um, I think it's a berry flavor and very sweet. Um, hopefully, I'll get a chance. This one is not quite ripe. Maybe in another day or two. But it's grown well for us. Again, this is just called Fat Fig. Thanks for watching.